Looking deeply inside nature through the magnifying glass of science, designers extract principles, processes, and materials that are forming the very basis of design methodology. From synthetic constructs that resemble biological materials to computational methods that emulate neural processes, nature is driving design. Design is also driving nature. In realms of genetics, regenerative medicine, and synthetic biology, designers are growing novel technologies not foreseen or anticipated by nature. Bionics explores the interplay between biology and design. As you can see, my legs are bionic. Today, I will tell human stories of bionic integration, how electromechanics attach to the body. And implanted inside the body, are beginning to bridge the gap between disability and ability, between human limitation and human potential. I'd like to finish up with one more story, a beautiful story, the story of Adrian Hoslet Davis. Adrian lost her left leg in the Boston terrorist attack. I met Adrian when this photo was taken at Spalding Rehabilitation Hospital. Adrian is a dancer, a ballroom dancer. Adrian breathes and lives dance. It is her expression. It is her art form. Naturally, when she lost her limb in the Boston terrorist attack, she wanted to return to the dance floor. After meeting her and driving home in my car, I thought, "I'm an MIT professor. I have resources. Let's build her a bionic limb to enable her to go back to her life of dance." Brought in、uh, MIT scientists with expertise in prosthetics, robotics, machine learning, and biomechanics, and over a 200-day research period, we studied dance. We brought in dancers with biological limbs, and we studied how do they move, what forces do they apply on the dance floor.、And、we took those data and we put forth fundamental principles. Of dance, reflexive dance capability, and we embedded that intelligence into the bionic limb. Bionics is not only about making people stronger and faster. Our expression, our humanity, can be embedded into electromechanics. It was 3.5 seconds between the bomb blasts and the Boston terrorist attack, and 3.5 seconds the criminals and cowards took Adrian off the dance floor. In 200 days, we put her back. We will not be intimidated, brought down, diminished, conquered, or stopped by acts of violence. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, please allow me to introduce Adrienne Hoslet Davis. Her first performance since the attack. She's dancing with Christian Leitner. Slow. 